on 16th December 1972, a village in northern Mozambique virtually disappeared from the map. Wiliyamo saw its inhabitants killed one by one at the hands of the Portuguese military, who invaded the territory during the colonial war. Take a look at the story. On the eve of the 50th anniversary of the massacre, only four survivors can tell the story in the first prison. According to Vinte Ganda, a survivor he still remembers how he lost friends and neighbors, and yet the population remained silent when asked about their support for the tourists, the name given to the combatants of the Mozambique Liberation Front, the Frelimo, who is currently in power. The survivors acknowledge that their courage was essential to maintain the independence moment. Gusino carries in her body the testimony of that day. Gusino added that, amid his tears, they put them in the same place. The men went to a line and whoever tried to escape was killed while the women were sitting. It took almost five decades for Portugal to acknowledge the Wiriyamo massacre. This year, Antonio Costa apologized to Mozambique for the barbarity committed during the colonial war and act that, in the words of the Portuguese Prime Minister, is inexcusable and dishonors the memory of the country.